first guitar was a was a was a was a Samick Stratocaster replica, and the uh, what comes to mind the first song I could remember trying to learn was uh, "Come As You Are" from Nirvana. Man, I should have had that one loaded. Uh, I well, there's so many, there's so many. But if I was to, I just off the top, like what comes first? Um, this is gonna sound really crazy, but probably John Petrucci. I always felt like he could play guitar like a singer. His melodies are just beautiful. His legatos, and and I love how he can just his alternate picking, like he can shred it up. And he can go there, you know, train the thought. He can like go there, but then he could like give you a solo like The Great Debate or something. And it's just like, just this beautiful melody. Um, I, I just, I love that versatility. I, I'm a solo guy. Like when I'm playing, you know, I, I'm, a, I'm a rhythm guitar player by nature. You know, I, I sing first and foremost, and then the guitar just accompanies that. But when I'm by myself, man, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to, you know, learn, learn my beats, you know, get, get good on that, you know? I just, I've, I've always been into that. I think the song Light On, it's a song on her last record, Blessings. Um, I just really love that song. And I, and I get a lot of people who, who, who message me about that song. And, um, you know, it, it's just about anybody who works really hard for a living and has to sacrifice the time with the people they love which I feel like a lot of people can relate to. Um, but in my instance, it's, it's uh, rock and roll. That's my job, you know? But I get, I, I get comments from people who, you know, electricians or, or fellow musicians, but you know, anyone can kind of relate to that song. So, because it connects to so many people, it makes me the most proud. Okay, yeah, to, to me personally, my, my favorite guitar solo is The Great Debate from Dream Theater. Oh, I love that song. It's insane. I try and learn it every year of my life. Right when he starts doing like the legato, it's like it just starts to fall apart for me. But I have like most of it. Yeah, up until yeah, right where it gets to the crazy legato. Um, <laughs> one day I try every year though. I, I still try. So the best advice that I got was from my um, one of my best friend's older brother, who kind of shepherded me into playing. And he told me to just put the guitar in your hand at least for 30 minutes a day. You don't even have to play it. If you're sitting down watching Netflix, just put the guitar in your hand. Get comfortable with that instrument and get used to the feeling and where your body is comfortable holding it and having hands. And, and just start there. Just, just hold that guitar for a half hour every day. Watch what happens. 